This is a Game Caviar production. Another day, another Grand Theft Auto 5 video. Not having it in the Game Caviar studio. Playing some Grand Theft Auto 5. Of course, what other game am I going to play right now? I, I don't really have that many games. I traded in like most of my games to get the collector's edition, which is awesome. The Los Santos hat, the, the, uh, the blueprint map. That you can use right, a uh, UV light on it, uh, black light, or whatever you want to call it. Uh, it's a lot of secrets on that map. I talked about it in my last video, so go check it out to uh, get all the details. Anyway, this particular heist, this mission right here is a heist. And this reminds me somewhat of uh, Payday 2, which is Payday series in general. Only, wow, my words. Uh, mostly Payday 2, because uh, if you played Payday or know anything about it, um, it's a really delicious candy bar, and uh, I eat them uh, here and there. No, the game is really cool. Basically, in Payday 2, you have different places that you basically have to rob, basically. I love the word basically, obviously. But uh, you, you just go in, you plan your heist, and you have like a jewelry store, a nightclub, uh, so, uh, like a mall, some shops in a mall, things like that. And I don't know whether Rockstar is taking a shot at them or just trying to work their way around it. I don't, I, I don't think they are. But um, it's this is really cool. This is like a more in-depth payday heist, so to speak, and it's really fun. It, uh, it, it reminds me of the the mission on Grand Theft Auto 4 where you have to rob the bank, except you don't. This. The thing is, before you started this mission, they gave you a choice of whether you want to go in and shooting guns and doing all this uh, reckless crap, or you can do what I did, which was gas the people inside, make sure they're asleep, have the hacker you know, override the security system, and then you go in, you take some jewelry, and then you leave. Pretty cool. And this isn't the only heist that I've done but at the same time it adds a really fun element to this game another thing that i like about this game is the three character element thing the the, the three character element is you switch between characters like right now i just switched to franklin and what's really cool about it is that when you're not in a mission you can switch between the three characters and they're all doing crazy things when you uh switch to them uh, not necessarily crazy things, but they're all, they're not just standing in the same place that you left them, you know. Like if I'm Franklin, and then I'm going to switch to Michael, then Michael could be coming out of a restaurant or coming out of the strip club, but Trevor could be like in a in a fight with somebody, you know. And I like the three character concept. It's something that they really haven't done. They haven't done it like this on Grand Theft Auto, in, in the Grand Theft Auto game before. So I like the fact that Rockstar is moving on and, and actually... You know, making the game innovative and that's what I appreciate in a game developer when they come out with new titles uh, I'm waiting for online to be activated I think it's gonna be awesome somebody was saying up to 32 players I don't know whether it's gonna be like that on console but again there are strong rumors and evidence to suggest that this game will be released on the PC as well as the P the PS4 and most most likely the Xbox one Newer systems obviously have better, um, what is it, better specs, and their servers will most likely be upgraded to, hopefully, fingers crossed, and they'll allow for more players to be online in the game match at the same time. They could do it on this gen, I don't know. I'm not into all the technicals involved in online gaming, you know, I just play it. I don't really look into how the structure and the architecture of it is. All I know is that I'm ready for it to be activated and I want to get online and I think it's going to be awesome. And since I bought the collector's edition, I get all the extra goodies. So, uh, if you know anything about online, like any rumors of when it's going to uh, be activated, let me know. And also, let me know what is the craziest thing you've done in this game. So far, not that crazy, but uh, you know, I took a stripper home and... I made sweet, sweet love to her, and that's about it, man. You know, I've stopped somebody from getting robbed and some other things. So let me know what the craziest thing that you've done 
And also, let me know if you know anything about the online part. Anyway, this has been Grand Theft Auto 5 on PS3, of course. I'm not having it in the game, Caviar Studios. And I'm out. This has been a Game Caviar production. Like this video and subscribe for more.